now guys it's already connected and here I can just uh, mark this auto download the updates simply guys now it's connected to my iPhone hello everyone uh, today I'm gonna show you how to connect Huawei watch to uh, any iPhone so as we know that Huawei watch can connect any software Android or even iOS so right now I have Huawei watch GT3 Pro and I will connect it to the iPhone 8 and same goes for any iPhone uh, device so simply uh, now the watch is ready to pair I need just to uh, open the app store and from the app store here I need to search uh, Huawei health just type uh, Huawei health as you can see here press Huawei health and you'll find it here just download it and wait until the download will be finished Uh, so uh, once the download will be done, just open Huawei Health and give all the permission. And here, just go for uh, devices and press uh, just give allow also and press add. And here you need to uh, create a new Huawei ID. You can use your phone number. Uh, or else you can use your email address so I will just uh, create my new Huawei ID and I'll come back to you uh, so as you can see now I uh, finish my uh, Huawei ID setup so uh, now I will just turn on the uh, health management and now guys I will go for devices again I will press add need also to switch on the Bluetooth now it will scan and uh, try to find your watch here you can simply uh, in the watch press use your QR code and in the iPhone press scan you need to wait until this line will be uh, uh, up to the end and in that time you can select the watch manually or else you can scan the QR code direct so you can see here the, the watch name is watch GT3 Pro CF0. So this code will be coming here in the screen. You can uh, either select it or, il or else you can just scan the QR code directly. Okay guys, as you can see here, I have uh, my watch is uh, watch GT3 Pro. Let me just try to find it. Yeah, here, GT3 Pro uh, CF0. Simply, I need to press uh, link. And now the iPhone will ask me to open your uh, Bluetooth menu and uh, connect it from there. And once you're done there, you need to come back to the application. So I will just open the Bluetooth and I will go uh, to find my watch here is watch GT3 Pro CF0. I will just press on it and in the watch to ask me to uh, uh, allow the uh, pairing. So I will just press OK. Again, I need to go back to the application. Now it will ask me more permission. Now open Huawei Health app. I need to press pair here and OK here. Now I'll give you, I'll give all the permission again. Now guys, it's already connected and here I can just uh, mark this auto download the updates. Simply guys, now it's connected to my iPhone and I can uh, control uh, what notifications I want to receive here. I can uh, enable or disable some of them like messages, WhatsApp, Facebook, Messenger, Gmail and others. So you can control from here if you don't want to receive any of the notification you can just turn all off so now you will not receive notifications if you want to uh, receive some and uh, disable some you can just uh, enable it again yeah 
even the watch faces also you can change it from here you can get more watch faces from the app itself some will be paid some will be free so it's up to you which one you want to download and the watch itself it has also some watch faces you can choose between it has almost like 10 or 9 watch faces which you can choose between them so here as you can see i have top a new and we have free also so you can go for the free one and here there will be ranking like number one number two and number three or the first and second and third so this is the rank or else you can go for uh, the other watch faces for example i i like to download let's see uh, let's say this one i'll just press install and automatically it will uh, install in the watch and it will be changing after installation will be done so guys as you can see that already the watch face is transferred to the watch and uh, uh, here you can also uh, check your battery uh, status uh, and also you can check the health management the ecg and also the but the thing here in iphone you will uh, lose some uh, functions like for example uh, the quick reply quick reply will not be available in uh, iPhones. if you connect the watch to the iphone the quick reply will not be there but if you connect the watch to any android or huawei phone for sure you will have the quick reply or option uh, plus also uh, the notifications here is limited so for huawei phones you can see uh, right now i'll show you the difference between if you will connect your watch to huawei phone or the iphone uh, right now i'm connecting my other watch gt2 pro to my uh, huawei phone and as you can see here i have a lot of options so i can uh, enable but my watch it doesn't have any uh, quick reply so uh, if i connect the watch gt3 pro to the huawei you will see quick reply you can see even music here i don't have the option to download music in the gt3 pro uh, however if i connect gt3 pro to my huawei phone I can simply uh, transfer music from uh, my phone to the watch and listen to the music direct from the watch itself but in the iPhone I don't have this option uh, plus also the app gallery so I can download more application on the watch if I connect to Huawei phone but this option is not available in uh, the iPhone as well so this is uh, most of the things if you connect in the iPhone is uh, limited only but in the Huawei phones and in Android it will give you more options and more functions uh, so guys if you have any question just drop your question in the comment section below and I will get I'll get back to you thanks for watching and I'll see you next time